Greetings. The commercial on television has Tom Selleck, an actor, looking out a window and saying, I thought what you thought. Reverse mortgages can't work. I'm not making this video to try and convince you to get a reverse mortgage. I am looking at what he assumed when he said, I thought what you thought. Thoughts are defined as an idea or opinion produced by thinking or occurring suddenly in our mind. Eventually thoughts are used to get someone else to do certain things or follow a way of doing something. Ways are defined as a method, style, or manner of doing something. God told Isaiah, for as the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways, and my thoughts than your thoughts. Isaiah 55, 9. And the Lord said this to the wicked, let the wicked forsake his way, and the unrighteous man his thoughts, and let him return unto the Lord, and he will have mercy upon him. And will abundantly pardon. I know this is commonly applied to a presentation of the gospel to convince the lost they need a savior, but the context is speaking to the house of Israel, whom God calls my people. Wicked thoughts and ways are not defining just the lost. The house of God also has problems with wickedness or unrighteousness in our thinking and ways. Ezekiel 18, 23, the Lord says, Have I any pleasure at all that the wicked should die, saith the Lord God, and not that he should return from his ways and live? The very next verse shows that God is speaking to the righteous man. who turns away from his righteousness and committeth iniquity and doeth according to all the abominations that the wicked man doeth. And the Lord says of that man, shall he live? That's in Ezekiel 18, verse 24. Then God tells Ezekiel about that righteous man who, who turns away from his righteousness and commits iniquity. And he says, all his righteousness that he hath done shall not be mentioned. In his trespass that he hath trespassed, and in his sin that he hath sinned, in them he shall die. Verse 24. Israel responded to this. They said, the way of the Lord is not equal. And God said, Hear now, O house of Israel, is not my way equal? Are not your ways unequal? Ezekiel 18, verse 25. Tom Selleck said, I thought what you thought. How many think like Israel when God told them your ways are not equal? I should say, how many believers think this isn't fair? If the Lord will not remember the righteousness we have done because of sin, iniquity, or trespass in our walk or ways. Application of these texts are not to be made in relationship to the gospel of salvation. These things are about how the righteous walk, how the righteous think, if it is contrary to the word of God. We, although shall be saved, are still held accountable for the way we think and do things. We will stand before the Lord and give an account of the life we live before him. That's when he decides whether he's going to remember the things we did or forget them based upon how we walked as a believer.